Hello YouTube friends, welcome to my channel, The Travel Diary Lullabs Edition. This is Rai Rai with my husband travel buddy Alan. It's our first day here in Budapest in Hungary. And from our previous video, we went on a city tour bus to have a brief idea of what to see in this beautiful city. Join us by watching this video as we begin to explore this global city, capital of Hungary. But before we do that, please don't forget to subscribe! Budapest is Hungary's capital. It is bisected by the river Danube. Its 19th century chain bridge connects the hilly Buda district with flat Pest. A funicular runs up Castle Hill to Buda's old town, where the Budapest History Museum traces city life from Roman times onward. The star of the Danube is outrightly known for so many famous things. For instance, the rich culture, underground caves, Danube River, the drop-dead beautiful parliament building, the local delicacies, and being the world's past capital. If you're wondering if Budapest is worth visiting, the answer is 100% yes. That is the reason why this is one of my top travel bucket lists. As one of the most underrated capital cities in Europe, every corner of Budapest oozes with history, charm, and beauty. The city's architecture is unrivaled, and the museum are fascinating. This Hungary's capital is blessed with a bounty of Art Nouveau architecture, quirky ruined bars, and gorgeous bathhouses, replenished by mineral-rich hot springs. Aside from its nicknames Heart of Europe, Queen of the Danube, Pearl of the Danube, Capital of Freedom, Capital of Spas and Thermal Baths, and Capital of Festivals, Budapest is a global city with strength in commerce, finance, media, art, fashion, research, technology, education, and entertainment. Hungary's financial center, it is the second richest capital and city in the region after Bucharest. The central area of Budapest along the Danube River is classified as the UNESCO World Heritage Site and has several notable monuments of classical architecture, including the Hungarian Parliament and the Buda Castle. The city also has around 80 geothermal springs, the largest thermal water cave system, second largest synagogue, 
and the third largest parliament building in the world. Budapest attracts around 12 million international tourists per year, making it a highly popular destination in Europe. Budapest is strategically placed at the center of the Carpathian Basin, lies on the ancient route linking the hills of Transdanubia with the Great Plain. By the road, it is 216 kilometers southeast of Vienna, 545 kilometers south of Warsaw, and 1,565 kilometers southwest of Moscow, 1,122 kilometers north of Athens, 788 kilometers northeast of Milan and 443 kilometers southeast of Prague. After the city tour, we went back to our hotel, which is the H2 Hotel Budapest. By the way, this is highly recommended because it is very near the parliament building. We decided to rest and take a nap since it is getting more hotter from the outside. Before it becomes dark outside, we took some photos of St. Stephen's Basilica and tried the famous gelato of Budapest. As you can see, there is a long line because there is something unique on how they serve this gelato. They arrange and form it into sort of like a rose flower on a cone and it looks so nice aside from it tastes so good. Tourists are fascinated to have their gelato in a rose flower shape and they are willing to wait for their turn just like us. Look how cute my gelato in mango and strawberry flavors. There you go! We got our rose flower shaped gelatos! St. Stephen's Basilica is now closed for visitors, so we just decided to take some photos in front of it. And before the day ends, of course, we had dinner in a Japanese restaurant just on the side of St. Stephen's Basilica. There you go, YouTube friends! I will end our video here. 
but definitely not the end of our travel adventure here in the beautiful city of Budapest in Hungary. Watch out for the continuation of this travel video as we continue to unlock the amazing tourist attraction of this city. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to like, share, leave a comment, subscribe and hit on that notification bell for more updates. See you again on my next travel video. Bye for now.